But the White House pushing back against the claims that the whole thing was a prisoner swap to get Mr. Gross home, essentially trading him for three Cuban spies jailed in the United States. You are not going to stand there and say that Alan Gross's release had nothing to do with the release at the same time of the three convicted Cuban spies. Well, it's all part of the same deal. How can you say that the... Uh, I mean, Alan Gross has released three spies released. I understand you also have a, a, a Cuban who was uh, working with U.S. intelligence who was released at the same time as part of the same package. But you can't say that the Alan Gross release is unrelated to the release of these three convicted yeah. Cuban yes, spies. I, yes, I can. Really? I just did. Unbelievable. Mm. I mean, if they, if they didn't want that to be the appearance that everybody would have in this country, they could have at least separated it by a few weeks. You could have brought Alan Gross home yep. and then a month later say, you know what, we've been working on this with the Cubans, we've made some progress, we think we're going to start talking to them yeah. about normalizing relations, but that's ridiculous.